one of the prelims for the 2019 National Science and Math Quiz, Pando Senior High School, Notre Dame Girls Senior High School, Volga Girls Senior High School, Tia Amas were victors in their context. Here's Maxwell Agbaba joining us live from Lagon. Maxwell, tell us what's going to be happening today. Well, Mama V, um, I'll be telling you what will be happening um, today shortly. But um, on what happened yesterday, uh, we've already recorded um, some interesting um, contests yesterday, actually. Uh, the problem of the day um, really proved um, to be a problem of the day for a lot of the contests. Um, I heard you speaking to Bernard Mona, and he said Laura Senior High School is the best senior high school um, in Ghana. Nancy Amifa Jadozi was at the NNB where Laura SHS actually um, contested tested um, Laura SHS problem of the day uh... it was a zero score for all three schools not even a single mark so Boga Girl scored zero Laura scored zero and Gifty and Dapia school a Shaiman SHS also scored zero but at the end of all, at the end of it all, Bogatanga qualified with 24 points. Um, Ashaiman had 20 points, and sadly, Bernard Mona School had eight points at the end of the contest. At the end of the contest. At the end of the contest. Okay. Okay. So would, they would have to keep their fingers crossed to find out whether eight would qualify as one of the 18 highest losing schools before they can qualify into the next round. If not, we're saying goodbye to Laura at this stage. Oh. Okay. <laughs> interesting. But if you come here to the University of Ghana Business School, also we had some interesting um, um, contests here. Um, the first contest was Chemu Senior High School, EPC Mauko Girls, and then um, St. Mary's um, Lulubi. At the end of the contest, um, Chemu Senior High School had 53 points. Um, EPC Mauko Girls, um, they had 25 points. St. Mary's Boys Lulubi, they had um, 22 points. But coming into this competition, um, MFA, it was expected um, that Chemu Senior High School um, would qualify to the 1-8 stage you know, of the competition from that particular contest because um, at the Great Accra Regional um, Championship, the maiden um, Great Accra Regional Championship, they actually um, beat Presec Ligon. And in that particular um, competition, um, some months, some days ago, I should say, um, they had about 54 points. Presec Ligon had 36 points. So really, um, it was expected that they were going to um, win that particular goal. I, I believe so. I mean, when I when I heard that they had beaten Presec Legon and also given Achimota a run for their money, yeah. I knew that these guys were in for the game. Yeah. Like, they knew what they were about and they were coming in with strong force. I was not surprised at all yeah. when I saw that they had won about 50, 54, 53 points um, against the other schools. I even feel that, that they didn't even do much because looking at what they did at the regional level, I think that they could have even you know, done better yesterday. But I mean, it's impressive. But, you know, I was at NNB and I recorded the highest point so far in the competition. T tell us, tell us about that. At Palm Senior High School, how were they able to do it? And the um, surprising thing about that contest is Winneba Senior High School. I'll be telling you uh, why <laughs> uh, we can't get comfortable um, making predictions yeah. with the scores from the regional competition. Exactly. So tell us what happened. All right, so um, during the regional com contest, Winneba was in port A, which meant that they had the highest score in the region with about 45 points. Exactly. Okay, and then we have a Palm Senior High School in second place with 35 points, with Dabuasi having 21. But the point is that, Look, if you want to look at follow the table from port A, port B, port C, you would say that Winneba should take this because I mean they had 45 points. Yeah. But Apam Senior High School came in right from round one. They took an early lead. They 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 answered all the riddles, like you know they were consistent. I think the only place they actually had trouble with was um, the true or false. That's where they faltered a little bit. But at the end of it all, they managed to put 62 points. Yeah. It's what's, what's, what's great improvement um, for a Palm Senior High School because in the regional competition, uh, they had 35 points in the regional competition. So from 35 points, just some days preparations for NSMQ national competition, 62 points. That is really uh, uh, something that we need to applaud. But for Winneba Secondary School, they saw a drop. In the regional competition, they had 45 points. And now in the national competition, they had 21, 21 points. Yes, that's more than half. Yeah. More than half. And the difference between them and APAM will be 41. Mm. That's how big you know, the margin is. And so it should tell you that 
yes, you could be at, at what A school, but you don't need to feel complacent because no matter what, the other school is also coming up with a game. Okay. So you need to play it on their level. Great. So um, for other schools um, that have qualified to the next stage of the competition, the 1-8 stage, we have Pando SHS, we have Borga Girls, we have TI Amas, and then we have um, Kumasi um, High School. I'll be telling you more about Kumasi High School shortly. But we have the girls from Notre Dame. Um, yesterday, they won their contest and they've qualified to the next stage of the competition. We've been talking a lot about um, women empowerment. We've been talking a lot about um, women in leadership positions. It start right from here, the National Science and Mass Quiz. Uh, you won your contest um, yesterday. What's the feeling like? It's very interesting and we're, it's very interesting and we're very happy yeah, to win our contest and we hope to qualify for the quarterfinals and semi-finals and probably the finals too. Probably the finals. Well, uh, uh, what's the name? Yakubu Sherifa. No school, no girl school, I should say, um, has won the National Science and Mass Quiz for over 20 years that it has been in existence. In fact, no school from your region, um, from the Brongafu region, has ever won the National Science and Mass Quiz. Uh, do, do you think you guys can make it this time around? Can you make your region and uh, make your school proud? Inshallah, we are going to break the record this year. We're going to break the record. What, 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 what makes you so confident? Because God favor is with us this year. We are going to really make it, going to the finals this year. God favor is with other schools too. Well, we've really prepared, we've worked hard because we saw that this year, like last year, no school from BA was seeded. So this year we came really prepared for it. We are going to win, inshallah. <laughs> What's the name? Uh, Mabina. Mabina. Okay. What, what do you make? Uh, what do you think it's the problem? Um, science and math school is no girl school has ever wanted. Mm, tension counts. Girls get tension. Tension. Okay. Better. But apart from that, it will be cool. Mm. We can still make it. Because this year you're not going to be tensed like how the guys make a tense all the time. So this year you're going to make a difference. So are you saying that the girls are able to, uh, the boys are able to handle the anxiety, the adrenaline rush, they're able to maintain their composure even around that time, is that what you're saying? Uh, sometimes, it depends on the individual as well. Mm. Some girls are not so tense. I don't get so tense on stage. But normally, girls are really intimidated by the guys, the way they answer the questions and stuff, but this year we're not really going to get down with, with that. So. Okay. okay. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure your mates are watching um, right now. What do you have to tell them? <laughs> I want to tell them that you, you really make them proud, and they should so continue believing in us because we came here very prepared. Mm -hmm. We are going to fulfill our promise, and we'll make it. You're going to fulfill the promise. What, what do you do? You also have to say. Oh, they should continue praying for us. That's all that counts right now. God's prayers, because we've done our part. The rest is with God. You've done your part. Truly, you've done your part. So <laughs> you're waiting for God to uh, to take control. Iradim Bejistian, is that not what you guys see? <laughs> okay, thanks so much for talking to us, Notre Dame girls. All the best um, at the next stage of the competition. So now let's quickly take you through um, what will be happening um, today, today's round of contest. We'll do that um, quickly and then um, we hand over um, to you, Mama V. St. Augustine's. We know four um, former winners of the National Science of Mass Quiz are contesting um, from the preliminary you know, level here at the national competition. In fact, they started um, from the regions. Um, Ghana Secondary Technical School, Pope John's. Um, we also have Achimota School and then uh, and then St. And then St. Augustine's. Yes, St. Augustine's, um, they are competing um, today. Yes, um, Nancy, can you tell us which school they are coming up against? Competing against Borga Senior High School and Wale Wale Senior High School. So those are the schools they are competing against. But I'm sure that if, if you ask anybody to predict that particular contest, I'm sure that everybody would say that, oh yeah, so we're going to be working in a park for um, St. Augustine's College. Because I mean, they've been absent for two consecutive years. They haven't been here. So they are coming with some sort of hunger within them. And so I'm, I'm sure that... They actually won the um, championship in the central region. They beat Adisado College and then Wesley Girls um, at a, 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 in, in the central region. And in fact, at the regional level, uh, if you are comparing their points, they had 54 points. They're coming up against Bolga Secondary School. They had 36 points. Wale Wale Senior High School had 28 points. Conf uh, I mean, you can confidently say 
it's gonna be you can confidently say unless Boga Senior High School decides to pull an APAM Senior High School. Okay, <laughs> that's interesting. Okay, so back here at the University of Ghana Business School, we'll, we'll have Fijai SHS um, versus Vakpo SHS, and then uh, Ibuakwa State College. Yeah, and then um, Navrongo SHS, um, Tuasu, is it Tua? Tuase SHS and then Kumasi High School. Kumasi High School, they scored the highest point at the regional level. They had 77 points. You need to watch out, you know, um, for Kumasi High School. The third round of competition here will be Trinibu Akodia and then Buam Ponseng SHS and then Inkawe S. HTS. Yes. Also Tell us. Interesting. Another interesting one. I, had, um, I have Armed Forces Senior High School competing against Nifa Senior High School and also um, Boma Senior High School. And then later, we, okay, I think this morning we either have Osei Tutu Senior High School, we have Insutaman Senior High School, and also Nafana Senior High School. So that's it. Um, the excitement will continue here at the University of Ghana Business School, and then the new and blog and trust join us will bring you comprehensive coverage of the 2019 National Science and Math Quiz um, on our social media pages uh, uh, just go there any information you need about the science and mask quiz you can get it but let me before uh, let's see what is happening um, in the auditorium here the seats are getting okay so that's Maxwell Agbaba showing us the auditorium that will soon be ready for uh, the first contest to get underway join the conversation just use the hashtag NSMQ on joy and you'll be updated with what's happening in the two centers at Lego Maxwell Agbaba and Nancy MFA Dradosi on that beat for us but go Notre Dame girls uh, all the support to you